This is all nonsense. It's all bullshit. I'm talking to corn. I'm talking to a guy who's dressed up as corn. Who gives a fuck? It's the internet. It's the wild west. It doesn't matter. You're not going to control my life. You're not going to change the narrative. I'll continue to do what I do. When I log off, you're out of my life. All of you fucks. I think you guys think because you live on Reddit, you live on Twitter. It's what it is. It's not real life. Nate Bargatze told me that. He goes, it's not real life. And it is. So motivation. Mm. What would you say motivates Chad Zumach to get up in the morning? Are you driven by relationships, money, success, fame? Do you, do you enjoy the drama of, of internet or what, what would you say? Fame. That's all I care about. I'm like Chrissy Mayer. I just want to be famous. So I want to be so famous, dude. You're saying Chrissy Mayer is so famous. Yeah. Yeah, no, I want to be like Chrissy Mayer level, Frank Pellegrino. I want to be that level. That's all I care about, dude. Like, they're so famous and infamous. I want to be at that level. That's all I care about. I'm like, can I get the Chrissy Mayer's fame? That's all I want. It, it, I mean, I, I don't know Chrissy or Frank, obviously, but I mean, speaking as a corn, I'd love to get to whatever level that is. Oh, um, yeah. Um, all right. Now here, here's one that'll, maybe this will be fun. Who the fuck knows? So this is, so I can get a better grasp of where you stand with certain people because this world changes so quickly. Can, can I read off a few names and you give me your honest assessment of your 100%. I'll give you. My okay. Name. Of your, your current status with that person and one 100%. meaning. All right. One meaning they're dead to you. 10 meaning they're in good standing and you'd consider them a friend. Okay. All right. Kevin Brennan. One. Come on. Levy. Two. It's Levy. Just a two? Two. Fucking two. All right. Kumia? Eight. Wait, you know, the higher the number means the the more you like them, right? Oh, wait. wait <laughs> re repeat repeat the, the scale. Okay. All right. Um. Uh, one means they're dead to you. Oh. <laughs> That's why I was like, Kevin Brennan, one? Okay, all right. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, well, Kevin, ten. Kevin, Bob, ten, nine. all right. Bob's a nine. All right, let's go. Right, we're we're rolling. Anth oh, shit. Kumi, I got a two. Okay. Um, <clears throat> honest answers. Gino. Zero. All right, we will move on from that one. Um, G Gino's a loser. He's a, like a complete loser. It's like not even a thing. <laughs> I've never really got got into him, but I mean, I just I just turned the channel. Yeah, uh, it's it, he's he's just not Everyone. not for me. But every um, I he's made me laugh occasionally, but it's I mean, you know, I got nothing against him. I like him. Um, Chrissy Mayer zero zero and Chris Frank, but put her because they're a combo. That's not one person. Chrissy Mayer is not one person. It's Chrissy and Frank. Opie last last name Opie. I don't have a problem with Opie. He's fine. I know, but we need it. We need a number. Eight. I don't, Shit, that's I, higher I, than I thought. I don't have no interaction with him, so I don't have a problem. Plus, Anthony's such a douchebag right now. Like Anthony's like going. He's he's pandering to Carl, Kumia. Wait, wait, no, he's part a uh, Carl, Gino, and Chrissy right now. It's like you're pandering to losers. Regrets. Are there any bridges that you would unburn if you could? Professionally or personally, comics are cocks. They're losers. They'll throw you under the bus any chance they get. Like Burt Kreischer, Sam Triplett. They'll all fuck you over if they can get ahead. So no zero regrets. This profession is stupid. It's dumb. I'm calling it out. People don't like it. I'm a problem. That's so, fun though, right? Uh, I mean, to a certain degree. But at the end of the day, I'd rather do other things. Like I'm having a great life outside of this i don't need to do this i'm trying to be a part of it and people are like ah oh, well why do you keep doing it because i never made it burt kreischer made it. he made 25 million touring last year 25 million dollars touring last year i never made it but you guys come at me like the psychopath that you are like i made it but i didn't make it so i will continue to do this so i can pay my bills i put myself in a bad position I love doing stand-up. I love writing the joke and performing it. I didn't sign up for this to talk to corn. This is stupid. This is retarded. 
No disrespect, corn div, but literally I'm talking to corn on I'm the taking. internet. Did George Carlin want to do this? Did Richard Pryor want to talk to corn on the internet? Nobody wanted. I just wanted to write jokes and tell him on stage, and now I'm fucking stuck talking to corn because I signed up for this bullshit. Go ahead. Next question. <laughs> What does it feel like to have come this far and arrived where you're at today? I arrived nowhere. <laughs> I'm in a fucking condo in Cocoa Beach waiting for my fucking show talking to corn. I've arrived nowhere. I've gone downhill. I was at my happiest when I graduated from college as a general studies major. Now I'm you feel fucking like, here. Do you feel like you push people away, though, that want to be your fans? Who gives a fuck? You're not my friends. You're but isn't you. that... But isn't I have that, friends in real life. Isn't that, <laughs> the internet's not real life. I don't give a fuck if you like me online. I have real right. life friends. I talk to them. I call them. I don't need some fucking loser on Reddit to be my friend. I don't need a guy who's dressing up as corn to be my friend. I'm good. But isn't that part of the... the no. You, you were saying you haven't made it yet. but it, Yes, because I don't know how to do it. I don't have success. it in me. I'll never make it. I'll never make it. It's not happening because I don't play ball. I'm not Burt Kreischer. I don't kiss ass. I don't suck up the corn and pretend like, oh, you're the best. You're awesome. You're the greatest. Who gives a fuck? It's, it doesn't matter. Uh, after this interview, I'll never talk to you again. It's, it's that simple. I mean, I'll still talk to you, Chad. 